edge of not moving along. You wouldn't think you'd say that about J.J., my favorite driver. Four first downs and four passes on first down for Ohio State. This one goes for... J.T. Barrett, open receiver, Jalen Marshall. Oh. Does not sink those hands into the cloth, get him on the ground. Ezekiel Elliott. Well, this is the growth of Ezekiel Elliott, the vision and patience in his running game as opposed to hitting it up in there and trying to run people over, let them pass plays down the field. Well, he's a math major, so he brings analytics into his decision-making on the sidelines. They bring a blitz. Barrett throws over the middle to the crossing Jalen Marshall, who gets taken down. For any type of defense to play man-to-man -man because they're so quick. Wilson takes the direct snap. Their version of the Wildcat. He breaks tackles and nearly broke it. Third and 15. Again, lots of time to throw on another errant pass behind Evan. He, he's decisive because he can pull the trigger and he's ready to go. He handed the ball off to Ezekiel Elliott on first down. And will play you can be in against a certain defense. And his growth and maturation in that area continues to grow. Tom Herman said, breaking down the tape, they think he's made the right decision in these zone replays about 85% of the time this year, whether to hand it off. Third down, seven. They are on the edge of field goal range for Nuremberger. That ball's on target, caught by Jeff Hireman. Barrett. Wow. Looked like he was surrounded. He pulled it down. And he's still running. Finally up. Again, no panic, no bad decisions. And he's a threat down the field when he runs with the football. He has deceptive speed and deceptive power. And he'll always get that extra yards. What I loved is he can go out of bounds right away. He got to second and goal. Barrett hit as he throws incomplete. Again, a fine player. He is one of those big-time recruits who did elect to stay home in his native New Jersey and play for records. Third and goal now. Barrett. ...from the five-yard line. Blake Lock running down. He snapped it with one. Barrett takes off running and scores. Continue. He can't throw it in. And you're an athlete like JT Barrett just run it in. They have man coverage, and everybody knows it, especially against the power of the conference, which is Michigan State, Wisconsin, and Ohio State, and Nebraska, all teams that pound the football. The pass to Elliott sets up third down and six. The pass to Marshall gets Ohio State a first down. And I look for Nick O'Leary to play big in his game tonight against Notre Dame, the tight end. Barrett sets and throws. Winston can handle it, and you know, for all the stuff that's gone on off the field, he can compartmentalize as, as well as anyone I've seen at this level. I don't think he's going to have a problem against that Notre Dame defense, and I think Florida State will have a, a good deal of success throwing the football. Played well enough to win, but they haven't hit stride, and tonight could be the night. I think it's going to be the night for them. Curtis Samuel got his first touch a moment ago. True freshman from Brooklyn, been bothered lately by an ankle injury. Now Rod Smith threw a pretty good hole, and he's out near. This will be his last series. They're up to 504 yards of offense. That's four straight games of 500-plus. And they'll add to that total on the catch by Corey Smith. College football playoff as well, if you're trying to make an even bigger impression on those committee members. Pass intended for Rod Smith. This four from Cleveland out of Glenville High School. Saw a brief action at the end of their route at Maryland two weeks ago. Samuel straight ahead of country, but is yet to play to that talent. Jones takes off running. And didn't run out of bounds. Maribag, he's on his feet. And getting whacked like a pinata. The Anthony Nixon. 14 more yards, that gets the Buckeyes over 300 yards rushing for the game. Aaron Toss, Jones saying it was a forward pass. So the Buckeyes take over with Cardale Jones at quarterback again. And a tussle today with Purdue.
but managed to win. And they're a factor in this Big Ten picture right now. Absolutely. And they run the football. Play tough. Well, Michigan State a couple of weeks ago to the point where the coaches were thinking about maybe making a change at center, but they thought he played very well at Maryland last week. Or last game two weeks ago. Cardinal Jones getting big chunks.